Hello Game Gumshoes fans. Today on Game Gumshoes presents Thieves. Yes, it's a cops and robbers kind of game. A fun little card game that, uh, you know, it, it takes a little bit. Um, I'm not going to say that it's it's one of those, you'll get right into it, it'll play perfect. No, it's going to take you a few rounds to get used to how the gameplay works. And then once you figure out how the gameplay works, fun little game. Now, um, I'm going to show you some highlights of the game. I'm not really going to go over how to play it because that's in the written review down below or on the, the WordPress page or let's, it could be on Facebook for all that matters. Uh, but some of the things I want to cover. The box. The box is really cute. Check it out. It's compartmentalized. Your cards go here. Your treasure, or your, well, your playing cards go here. And then this is just a little slot for uh, your diamonds. Um, since I did say diamonds, I'm referring to these. They're not actual diamonds. They are just little plastic things that look like diamonds. But still cute all the same. I know I keep referring to it as cute, but this is a thieving, vicious game where you're actually trying to um, set each other up for failure and um, end up uh, not getting arrested and wind up uh, ending the game with the most gold. Um, you will have these nice convenient little cheat cards. The cheat cards explain what each of the different symbols mean and um, when they're allowed to be played. Um, you will draw cards, you will play cards. Um, some of the cards you will play are um, treasure cards which, this is one, you can see the little treasure bag down here. Uh, they do range from zero to three cards, um, or zero to three gold points. Um, you do have special treasures, like the ring and the horseshoe. Um, when the police come, the horseshoe is not worth but one, so it doesn't count as high on the radar. Um, but the ring does, uh, because, well, hey, it's a ring. It looks like it should be something. But at the end of the game, when the points are scored and everything like that, and the cops aren't trying to beat down your door, the horseshoe is worth three points, and the gold ring, well, it wasn't really gold anyway, so it's only worth one. So keep an eye out on that, because those are treasures that you can give to your opponents as well as keep for yourselves. And um, so when the cops come, they're going to arrest the person with the most gold, um, the way the cops come is the cops are called, and if you hit a certain amount of police officers in the field, then um, the cops are going to come out either way. Um, police come in one or uh, two helmets, uh, so you'll be able to see that. Uh, there are also thief cards that can be played, and um, you'll recognize them by the little red ring around the outside of them. Now, I know the siren has a red ring, but it's really a cop card. These are the thief cards. Like I said, they have the red ring around them and they can allow you to move treasures around and things like that and steal treasures and what have you. Uh, you can play cards on yourself or your opponents depending on how you play. Um, like I said, read the review down there. It will give you a little more idea. Uh, the cards are a nice cambric finish. I like the little safe back on it because, you know, when you put it into the box, you know, it looks like the thief is getting ready to break into the safe, and that, that, that's kind of cool. It, it put, means they put a lot of thought into this game. And for, you know, I think it's 12 bucks, it is, or 10 bucks even, it, it's not going to be that, you know, big of an outlay of money for something that you'll be able to play time and again. Um, but this is Thieves by Calliope Games, and um, give it a chance if you get a shot. Um, hopefully uh, you'll enjoy it just as much as we did. That being said, this is Chris with Game Gum Shoes, and I'll see you in the next review. Thank you.